Hey, uh, what's up? So today in this video I'll be making a whole letter just using AI and Photoshop. So yeah, I already said 50 likes and <coughs> I'll do this video. So here I am. I picked a winner for the header today on my Discord server. You can just join and then also enter giveaways like the one I did here. And this is the winner right now. Congratulations and yeah. So I will start with the text, therefore I'll head to Midjourney. If you don't know what Midjourney is, I basically used it in the last video to make these texts and then the final product was right here. So this text was made by AI and then of course a little bit of Photoshop because you need to, but yeah. That's basically just AI text right there, so kind of cool I guess. And in today's video I will be also making the render the text and all of the stock images or particles and stuff like that that I'm going to use. Everything made by AI. So yeah, let's just start with the same prompt I used there. So I just press on prompt and then change the text from planes to Aeolic. I hope I pronounced your name right. Then submit it and make sure to put the speed on fast again because I don't want to wait all the time and then just spam again so I can choose some good text examples and I'll see you guys soon. Alright so all texts are rendered. Let's just check them out real quick. So this one looks kinda good. I just upscale this one so we can save it for later. The other ones are not so good looking I guess. You also have to keep in mind that it's better with a black or white background, like here, because it's easier to erase. And you don't want to spend the whole time just masking and cutting it out. Mm. Not a big fan of the other text. Oh, this one is actually good. Yeah, I guess I'll just use this one. It's good. Uh, let's just check the other ones out too. But I think we already found the one. The final version. Of course you could just spam it until you get the, like the perfect text, but in this video I just want to go over everything pretty quick because the whole point of using AI is to speed it up. Okay, this is also kind of good because it got a 3D perspective. Mm. Yeah. I don't know about the rest. This one is good. Holy shit. It's actually for a Halloween style. But I'll upscale it. Uh, upscale it too. And yeah. So first one upscaled. Let's download it. Let's check if the name Aeolic. Yeah, it's, it's the right name. Again. Because you have to keep in mind that AI still sometimes messes up the text and font. So always check that every layer and letter is correctly named because otherwise it will be kind of cringe. Aeolic, that's the right name. Almost completed and then we can already choose a character. I would say we go with something from like Naruto because you have to keep in mind that AI, uh, AI still kind of has a hard time by doing anime characters from unpopular animes because there isn't enough data that they've been trained on, so keep that in mind. Oh, actually I haven't even opened up Photoshop yet. Let me fix this. <coughs> okay, so if you just type in the search bar on explore and then press like Sasuke, you can see AI can already do a pretty decent job on Sasuke. So maybe if I type in render, maybe someone has tried a render before, which doesn't seem like it is actually the case, but no worries, we can still make our own render, or just a wallpaper and cut it out. For example, this one could actually be a render, or this one, or actually this one is a pretty solid render again. Uh, uh, uh. Christmas sweater, let's go. Okay, so just open up a new file and then 
put in the format, then drag in the texts, and once you do, uh, you've done that, you can mask them out already. But I just get myself some renders right now, so change the mode if you wanna use anime style to Niji, and then basically always the newest version, I guess. I have no clue what this is. Ah, okay. I'll just fill this one out really quick so I can basically give it an anime style. Alright, so now I'm done training my model, I guess. Ah, still not, but okay, let's just continue anyways. So I'm going to change the aspect ratio to 3 to 4 because I want the render to be a little bit wider so I can use it as a main render and fill out much space. And then I just type in like Sasuke render wallpaper and some random stuff insane fighting uh, fighting scene comma render design and some random shit so yeah weirdness zero war uh, var variety holy shit I can't pronounce it what the fuck okay and then that should be it. Let's see what it will give us as an output. Let's actually change the AR to 5 to 3. So it's actually wider. I did a, bit, a little mistake right there. So yeah. Organize. Okay. Let's see what it will give us with this prompt already. But it seems like it's fucking shit holy fuck what the okay uh maybe sasuke from oh sasuke bushia from naruto shibuten come on sasuke come on Uchiha. maybe it's better now because this is not sus what the fuck this shit is curious holy fucking shit the fucking fuck fuck. The hell is this shit? Okay, he had actually understood that I want to render, but the fuck is this shit? Nah, hell nah. Okay. It's still shit. It's still fucking garbage. The actual holy fuck, okay. I will put some timestamps in here so you can just skip to the good part. Because what the fuck is this? Alright guys, so I just figured out what to change is basically just put the chaos and weirdness in stylize like a little bit down below and then yeah, you see much better results here. This is actually already pretty good, so I'm gonna upscale it. Uh, okay, I just look through everything right now. Maybe I find a good render already here. I mean, it's depending on the style you're trying to achieve, of course, but some of them could already be used as renders. Not this one. It's still not perfect, of course, but if you have a lot of time and want to make a special header for a client or just for yourself, I don't know. With custom render, you can get it, I guess. Yeah, just takes a lot of time to get a perfect render. This could actually be good. Let's blur it right now. Yeah, some of the designs are still kind of made and shit. But I guess I just used the ones I upscaled right here. 
this could actually be a main render, like in the middle. Just saving this run. Okay, the face is a little bit messed up right here. Here too. And I guess here too. Nah, that's not it, bro. Okay, I can complete the shit. Yeah, GG is the AI yeah, messed up the face, but I can still use the body. So now we are going to create particles. So I'm going to let a particle oh, uh, screen sprinkle, I don't know. And then AR 16 to 9. I just check it out in mid journey a few times, uh, in Niji mode. And then in normal mid journey mode, and let's see which results are better. Okay. Should be enough. Okay. You can't use Niji for particles, I see. I see, I see. Okay. Uh, just cut to the good part. Alright, so normal mode is way better. So I'm just going to create stock images too for smokes, because I need smokes. And then last thing I could maybe do text effect random Japanese text and then again stock image and uh, I forgot to change the aspect ratio. So AR and then 16 to 9. Fade back AR 16 to 9. Okay. Then duplicate it a few times and then I cut straight to it again. Alright, so now I'm gonna upscale this one, made in EG mode, and these particles, and also these right here, and the particles right here, and maybe also these ones. And then for the smokes, I don't know why, but it picked up smoking people instead of actual smoke. So, okay, this one is normal smoke, I can use this, and then the wallpaper of this good and I can just cut him out. Now for the Japanese text effects it's not that good but I can use this effect right here. And also this is actually fucking good. Holy shit. This too. So nice. I think I got everything that I need right now. All made by AI right here. And I maybe also release an AI pack with the full copyright so you can use it for commercial stuff and shit like that. If you're interested in this, just leave a comment down below and say, I, I want an AI pack or something like this. Okay, I just download the whole images right now and I cut to Photoshop right now. Step in that in the booth while I cook up in the booth. I'm all the thing is you do. I'm 